We're told the 18 year old was already in custody at the Volusia County Jail. Ethan Russell was being held in the mental health block for an attempted armed burglary charge. News 6's Lauren Korn is in Volusia County and explains how his note to officers could keep him keep him locked up longer. A judge granted Ethan Russell a $20,000 bond. However, he's been here at the Volusia County Jail since March on those charges you've mentioned. He's accused of writing a five-page handwritten note wanting to be a part of ISIS and wanting to blow up government buildings, including landmarks here in Volusia County. It's this five-page handwritten note that has 18-year-old Ethan Russell facing a felony charge. Uh, you're here on the charge of uh, written threats to kill or do bodily injury. Russell remained quiet in court today, but expressed his passion for wanting to join a terrorist organization and harm innocent people in this letter. Deputies say he handed to an officer while in jail. The letter listed seven targets and among them the White House, the Orlando International Airport, the Amway Center, the Deland County Courthouse and the Daytona International Speedway. The letter also says, quote, these targets will be blown to kingdom come. I will do it and I'll make sure that I succeed. Deputies interviewed Russell, who told them, quote, if I get out, I'm going to join ISIS and be a sniper for them because the government put my dad in jail for crimes he didn't commit. Authorities say he also listed how he was going to make the bombs. Russell has been in jail since March, accused of breaking into a Deltona home and carrying seven large kitchen knives, a mask and gloves with him. I was contemplating uh, no bond for protection of the public. Russell's mother declined to comment but told deputies he's autistic and is in fear of her son if he's released because he could hurt her other two children. She also told deputies the father has been in and out of jail but it hasn't heard from him since 2008. In Daytona Beach, Lauren Corn getting results, News 6.